go ahead, Jim. Are we are we good? Whenever you want to be, man. Is our silence <laughs> over? Yeah. We've broken the chains like <laughs> Fleetwood Mac. We'll break Dude, that, the chain. That's not my genre, bro. We've arrived. Oh. We have arrived. I'm guessing we're going. It's the Jim Bob Show. <laughs> you want to? Yeah. Yeah, we can go. That's Let's cool. go. Let's do it. All right. So it is the Jim Bob Show. Thanks, everybody, for listening. And we're going to talk about some stupid stuff. I mean, we always do. Jim is going to talk about something from PlayStation 3. Um, other than that, we do have a guest. Our guest, guests, plural. <laughs> it's the plural sound of guests. Guests. You sound like a sprinkler. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Which sprinkler would be your favorite? Would it be the one that goes... No. Or the... My favorite is the tractor one. There's a tractor one? Yeah, it's a tractor that... Well, let's introduce the guest first, and we'll talk... Okay, okay, sorry. All right, so our guests tonight are a duo, and they have their own YouTube channel, like all of our other guests, but it is Golem and Goblin. Hey, how's it going? That's, Hello. That's Golem. That and second goblin. was Goblin. <laughs> so these guys are awesome. I've been, I think I've been watching you guys through uh, the, I heard you guys first on the Instant Replay Live channel. God, we mentioned those guys a lot. They must be cool or something. Yeah, they're sort of the godfathers of YouTube at this point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. As far as this troop is concerned. Yeah, I would say that. But yeah. I mean, you guys, uh, Golem, I think I've been watching your playthrough of Bioshock Infinite. And man, I have so wow. many strong feelings about that game. You've been watching it. That's good. <laughs> you know, you've been watching you've been the, with your eyeballs, you've been watching it? Isn't that the point of YouTube? That's what we you know. <laughs> hasn't been clear to me until now. <laughs> All right, Damn. so this is the part where you guys go ahead and d- describe what your channel is, what you guys try to do, what you like to do. Um, why should somebody come to your channel? Go ahead, anytime. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Well, we've been doing a lot of Let's Plays for the most part. Um, The reason why you should come and see us is uh, maybe you shouldn't. I don't know. Nice. Hey, Solomon Goblin, come see us, but probably don't. But don't. Yeah, yeah. Just fair warning. (laughs) Don't bother. Okay. All right. These guys, they have more... (laughs) I'm going to I'm going to promote your channel for you. Oh, thanks. Yeah, that's These guys have great. more than just let's plays. There's four people that put into your channel, is that right? Right. Yes. So there's Golem who's on here, Goblin who's on here, Slime, yes, yes. and Fishface. <laughs> Frogbat. Frogbat. I was close. Frogbat. Fishface Fish is nice though. I like that. <laughs> that. Dude, that was totally guessing. Um I'm glad we were kind of close. Yeah, that'll have to be the fifth member. Fish face. Fish face. Yeah. <laughs> Are you going to be you, Bob? He could definitely be you. He could be honorary fish face. <laughs> wow. Yeah, we can do that tonight. It doesn't take it doesn't take much to be part of our troop. Do Maybe I have to can. give you some of my blood? Uh, yeah, we need about an ounce. One full man. But that's it. It's funny. It's funny you guess that. It's, that's all we need. Can I give you plasma instead? Mm, yeah, but it has uh, to be a gill. <laughs> what? A gill. We need a gill of plasma. <laughs> nice. Nice. And a strand of hair, actually. I forgot about that part. I always forget about the hair. <laughs> Just in case we lose you. Are you going to make a hair yeah. doll of me? Yeah, no, but it's making like a teeth. Because <laughs> <God. laughs> we're making a life size doll of Bob over there. No, all you need <laughs> left is semen. Did it oh. go? Woo! It's going to be like, it's gonna be like Golem science. Got that, didn't you? What's that? I think Golem got that. Yeah, a while ago. Is it still good? I, I heard it doesn't have a long good? shelf life. Is it still I good? A, I have a freezer. What are you talking about? Yeah, it's good. <laughs> what oh. is the shelf life of semen? <laughs> hey, wait. How deep uh, are we into the episode this time? We're, I mean, we're we're about balls deep right now. <laughs> what's, what's the uh, consistency? I mean, like, so if you put it in between your fingers, do you get, like, a long strand of goo? Or does it just, like, well, snap together I'm, really quick? I'm, I'm going to say we should go back to talking about sprinklers. <laughs> yeah, yeah, maybe. <laughs> oh, I mean, the other stuff is probably related to diet and genetics, but... Yeah, probably. I mean, I've, I've heard, this is speculation, I've never tried, that if... <laughs> You eat a lot of pineapple before it tastes like pineapple. Huh. Think about it. I, Think about it. 
I kind of like those coffee. sprinklers that like spread out and they, <laughs> they go forward and back and you can jump through them. Those, yeah, those were cool as a kid. Yeah, mine's definitely the one where it does a lot of fast movements. Makes me feel engaged. But what so so what I was talking about was a tractor. So it's a tractor that you hook a hose up into the where the hitch would be, and then it it it's just like a twirly madu. It's a real word. Yeah. Do you know what I'm talking about? I mean, do you know what do you, you are you guys aware of this? No, no. all I know what whirly majigs are, not twirly majus. Oh, okay. Sounds that's pretty fair. racist, by the way. <laughs> Jim, only you would think that's racist. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> and let me, for the record, say that Judaism is not a race. <laughs> not um, at all. But <laughs> anti-Semitic. You're anti-Semitic. <laughs> Stop it. Stop. Oh, no. Oh no. All right. Just so we're done. <laughs> so this is <laughs> we're gonna move into the next section, which is gonna be the playlist. And this is where we're talking about pretty much what, what you guys are playing. Um I thought you weren't gonna call it the playlist because you said everybody calls it the wanna, playlist. What do you want to call it? Do you wanna call it the, <laughs> stuff, the stuff list that of you plays? play? Stuff, stuff that, you, that play. you play. Are you making fun? You guys you guys need like those musical cues. Like now it's time to move on to what do you play? Wow. You know what I mean? No, can you can you... use that if you want. It's free. You can have it. Trademark. Trademark Goblin. Trademark. Goblin's been trademarked. <laughs> can I stamp you? Yeah, you can stamp me. Whoa. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> or, does or does it? <laughs> or does it? <laughs> I'm done. Stop your play! <laughs> Uh, all right do it okay we're gonna we're gonna use this i want you to do your best stuff you play and so goblin you say it golem give him a beat oh sweet all right golem go stuff you play nice i'm gonna use it guys just so you know i'm gonna insert it into every fucking episode we do please do oh yeah yeah that'd be great (laughs) <laughs> I've been looking for a way to become immortal, and I think this might be it. Oh, yeah, we are gonna we are gonna go on forever. <laughs> if you want to die in obscurity on the internet, there you go. Yeah, <laughs> I get never mind. The pyramids will erode before that goes away. <laughs> Eroding. Eroding. Name that movie. Uh, Independence Day. Nope, it's uh, Bruce Almighty. You guys have failed. And I was guys, really close. You, know, you guys are. You guys I remember are, that scene, Independence Day. You guys are kicked off the show. <laughs> Damn it, we lost. Actually, Jim, you're kicked off the show. <laughs> Stop you playing! <laughs> so, okay, no, we're really going to talk about that. So, um, what? We're, we'll go with the guest. We are off to a great start. Eight minutes in, we're just to the playlist. Or the Stuff You Play! Stuff You Play! I suck at it. Um, so, we'll start with, we'll start with, I'm just going to pick one randomly. Golem. Yes. Now this is now I don't want you to talk about what you're playing on your channel. Just something outside of YouTube that you would like the the vast millions of people that listen to the show to know about. Well, there's two things. Uh one, does it have to be a video game? I need to ask that. No. Um well you could no. play board game? D and D. A lot okay. of D and D. Okay. I've been running D and D games for about a decade. And I've been running the same campaign for a couple of years now. Holy cow. That's been a lot of fun. Uh, They're eight, level eight. It's been Um, about a couple of years? Yes. I'm using a very slow XP progression. Oh, okay. Fair. Yes. (laughs) They have, like, side characters now, and it's getting, getting pretty bananas. Do you do voices for every new character? Every no, uh, but many yes. Do you rehash most, most the same have. voice? What's that? Do you rehash the same voice? Oh, it depends on the character. Like uh, the the NPCs that uh, are maybe more important usually get a little bit more flourish than uh, some some of the other characters. So give us your give us your best NPC voice right best. now. Uh, yes, you well, two I could seconds. Do, One. I could do Corley. Okay, do it. <laughs> I've got an opportunity for you if you're willing to have it. Nice. It's kind of yeah, Irish, yeah. 
<laughs> What's that? Is there a little Irish accent in there? Yes, absolutely. My my range goes from me to me. I can't do anybody else at all. I have no I have no voices. I suck at them. <laughs> I I fear that I'm terrible at them, and then I I worry that I think I'm better than I than I actually am. <laughs> Nice. So and I, then I, everybody's like, yeah, that sounds okay. Go <laughs> okay. Stop. I don't want to hurt you. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> your feelings. Um, but I, I've actually, so I've never played D&D up until recently. Jim, I don't think I told you about this. Um, I've never played it, so go right ahead. So I listened to a podcast called The Zone Cast. Um, it's with the McElroy brothers. They're fucking hilarious. And they're playing fifth edition. So they do it all over a podcast. It's awesome. I'm going to recommend that to everybody. Listen to it. It's awesome. I don't care if you don't like d and I hated D&D up until it. And then I tried. So about four weeks ago, I tried for the first time. And I made I made myself a Typhling Warlock. And I've gone, I've started at Lawful Good. And now I've made my way into Evil. So a character arc. I like that. I'm yeah. a big fan of that. We got, mm-hmm. we got trapped in a dungeon. And uh, the only way out was a teleporter. But I made one of the NPCs try it before we did. <laughs> <laughs> and the, the, my party didn't like that. Did the NPC get his shit rearranged by the teleporter? No, it didn't work. <laughs> That's too bad. <laughs> All right. All right. What, what's your second one? Go on. My second one? Uh, Fallout 4. I've been <laughs> playing a lot of that, like most of your guests. <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, who? Like pretty much everyone who exists right now. Except, yeah. Except Jim. Except oh, Jim. yeah. Hey, Jim, how's Fallout 4? <laughs> Stuff you play! <laughs> it's fantastic. <laughs> nice. Got, nice. Got a lot of Fallout in it, and there's like four of them, so it's like really good. <laughs> What's your favorite song from Fallout 4? Uh, uh, you know, Adam, I think oh, like the, like the beginning of it. <laughs> Jim, I, we all know you didn't play it. <laughs> I know. Sorry. Continue. <laughs> Continue. I'm saving face here. Leave me alone. What about okay, Golem? Favorite song from Fallout Four? Atom Bomb Baby. Is that? How does it go? <laughs> okay. <laughs> can I get Goblin's help? Yeah. Is that a thing I can no. do? Got it all, baby, and I love her so. Nothing else like her anywhere you go. Man, she's anything but calm. Regular pint sized atom bomb. Atom bomb, baby, little atom bomb. I want her in my wigwam. She's just the way I want her to be. A million times harder than TNT. Nice. Do I, do I keep going, or are we? No, going? you're good. You're good. That, was, that, was, that was well done, man. I've been that singing that at fantastic. work for a while. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I bet people hate you. Yeah, Goblin <laughs> hates it. Not, yeah. not, not because you're, you're you're bad at singing. I'm not saying you're bad at singing. Don't. Oh, I'm terrible at it. But it's because it's one of those fucking songs that will stick in your head forever, it's and there. you just can't get it out. Yeah. No, I can't. I really yeah. can't. <laughs> <laughs> so, so Golem, what are you playing, man? What? God, Goblin, you fuckers oh. need different first <laughs> initials. No, this is why this is why we did it. Everybody hates this. I hate it already. Everybody hates this. Right? Like Jim Bob, you're like, you're not gonna fuck that up. But Golem Goblin, yeah. It's just a it's a trap. We you set it up that way. Officially trapped me into your trap. Yeah, congratulations. So what what are you playing, Goblin? Goblin. Um <clears throat> I'm probably playing about the same stuff that golem is uh obviously fallout 4 a lot uh i also actually dm for uh dnt games but one game i've been playing a lot lately and I, I know i'm late to this party but uh magica i started playing magica recently is it because it's free on ps4 no i don't have a ps4 oh. is it free yeah for I spent like 50 on it magica 2 was free uh, oh okay <sighs> i'm not playing the second one i'm playing the first one Oh, okay, sorry. Go the continue. First... Talk about it. Um, it's surprisingly awesome. I have not. I didn't know anything about it, but uh, it was actually it was on sale on the Steam sale recently, and I picked it up because I wanted something that was co- sort of local co op that didn't look horribly difficult. Because I have a I have a little kid who's just just starting to get into gaming, 
And so I've been looking for stuff that we can sit down and play together. And um, yeah, it's actually, it's really funny. It's a comedy kind of game. It's like a top down um, uh, action RPG kind of, kind of thing. And uh, the magic system in it is really fun too. Cause you can basically, you have uh, access to a, a spell wheel and it has like different elements that you can combine to create different spells and you can um, learn spells as you go, or you can craft your own. So it's been really fun with like, with like having a little kid cause she just kind of goes nuts and creates all these weird spells and like explosions are happening all around us and we usually die, but nice. it's a ton. Of, it's a lot of, <laughs> it's a lot of fun. It's something that I I'm surprised. I just completely missed on my radar, but I definitely highly recommend it to. Ever. Yeah, no, I, I mean, I've only played Magicka 2 because it was free on PSN. Um, but man, it was it was a ton of fun. It has the same stuff you're talking about. And I like crafting the, the magic, you know, that's yeah. that's my favorite part. Yeah, it's a really cool system uh, mechanic and I haven't seen it in anything else. No, yeah, I agree, man. Um, Jimmy, anything to put on this? What, what, what was that? <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> anything you want to put on this? Oh, you you want me to tell you what I'm playing? Is that, no, is that no, no, no. Is there anything you want to, <laughs> you want to input into the guests' conversation that we have with them? Oh, oh. Did um, you know we I've have never, guests on tonight? <laughs> I've never I've never played any of those games. To the amazement, the shock of you, probably. <laughs> but yeah, I'm extreme. I'm extremely shocked, Timothy. I would be. I'd be very shocked. <laughs> to tell you the truth. Nice. Just out of left field. Nice. <laughs> It is yeah. crazy. So, what, Jim? What do you got for us? I yes, yeah, yes, Ooh, yeah. Ooh. I've got something for you. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so I um been playing because like when the game came out, I didn't have a very good internet connection. So I beat the game in the story mode, but then I've been playing it on the online mode lately. And I don't really like online, but I've been playing uh grand theft auto for a little while. Uh, I guess one. like, no, nah, like the newest one, five, the five or whatever. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Man, whatever that Ooh. one, I played that one and that one was, that that's kind of fun on the intranets, but like, it's hard to do shit, because people just run around and they kill you a lot, and it's kind of frustrating. <laughs> right? Yeah, that was my experience with that game, too, online. It's like, the second you get in, I think I, the second I got into that game, I was like, here we go, it's time to play Grand Theft Auto Five online, and some guy came by and, like, capped me in the head, and I died. And he stole all my money and took off, and I was like, this game sucks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's just, like, the worst like, shit ever. The guy was probably me. <laughs> <laughs> maybe and it's it's no fun to play it in safe mode because then like you can't even shoot the other people when you want to and you want to be that dick so it's like fuck that the and first, then i also what go for it. i was gonna say the first video i ever put on youtube was a tutorial on how to get into the military base to steal a plane oh jumping the rock over the thing or whatever yeah it was pretty cool yeah. it got like, oh, a, like it got like 100 views <laughs> Goblin has a uh, fun little role play story from Dr- oh. Grand Theft Auto. Do I? <laughs> yeah. You were invited to somebody's home. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. So, so <laughs> I. <laughs> My character in GTA 5 is a woman. And so I get into the game and I'm playing, and this car pulls up next to me. And I'm like, oh, shit, some guy's going to like totally off me again. And the car's honking. And I'm like, oh, this is another player. Okay, cool. So I get in the car and I'm like cruising with this person. And in chat, they're like, hey, how's it going? I was like, good. Where are you headed? And they're like, he's like, back to my place. (laughs) (laughs) Is that like a mission or something? (laughs) I started feeling really victimized. So then we get to this, we get to this huge like estate and he pulls into the garage and he's like showing me all of his cars <laughs> that he's collected, and he's like, <laughs> like, like I'm re- gonna be really impressed or something. And I'm like, oh, that's just cool, man. Yeah, cool cars. And he's like, yeah, let's go. So then he goes to the store. I follow him through the door, and he like we get into his like apartment area, <laughs> and he's like, his character points, and he's like, yeah, the bath's over there. If you want to wash some of that dirt and stuff off. <laughs> And I'm like, what the fuck are you talking about? Like, 
what? And uh, so I like just hung out in his apartment. He's like, there's wine on the counter. He goes and sits down and starts watching TV. And I could not what? for the life of me figure out how to get out of his house. Like, <laughs> because I just started playing this game. And I was like, so what, like, what do we, what do I, what the hell do I do here? And he's like, no, go ahead. Make yourself comfortable. Like have a glass of wine, go take a shower, take a nap on the bed. And I actually just shut the, t- I shut the game off. Because I couldn't get out of his house. I was like, this is so fucking scary. Like, I don't know what to do. I fucking dashboarded and ejected the game without even stopping. (laughs) I I, like, shut it down. I, like, took a minute to look at, I Googled it. I'm like, how the hell do you get out of other people's (laughs) You know? It was really horrifying. I'm like, I feel really victimized and, like, I've been kidnapped. Funny story. That was actually Jim. (laughs) I know. (laughs) And I've worked my way here, all the way here, just to tell you how horrible it made me feel. Thanks, Jim. Well, I only trapped you in my house because you didn't tell me how cool my Hummer was. <laughs> oh, jeez. Which kind? <laughs> but <it's>... Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Get it? Because Hummer's Shut another up. word for blade job. <laughs> Whoa. Shut up. <laughs> Shit, it is. Yeah. <laughs> Yep, it is. You know what's it's funny though? I have I do have another character on GTA five and he is a uh crackhead looking guy. <laughs> and it's amazing because I don't do this very much, but playing a female like avatar in a game, especially an online game, you're actually treated very differently. <laughs> it's it, for real, it's it's really weird. Like I don't know if Golem can talk about that because you play female characters all the time in games. All the fucking time. Yeah, I like to look at their curbs. I usually don't play. Uh, well, I don't play enough online games to really. <laughs> that's true. No, yeah. I, it, in World of Warcraft, I definitely got like kisses blown at me from the opposite faction, and given random shit when I was playing as a girl. But as a dude, I basically got attacked all the time. <laughs> nice and not helped. Like opposite right? of helped, maybe even hindered. Even I don't know. All video game sexism, man, it's real. It it's fucking real. <laughs> Bob, did right. you just? Did you just say you like to look at their curves? <laughs> that was Golem. What? <laughs> nice try. One, they're all faces. There are no actual curves. What are you talking about? I'm talking about geometry, man. No. There sure. are no actual curves. That's true. It is true. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> what else are you playing, Jim? Oh... Oh my god, this is awesome. Uh, this game <laughs> called Fat Princess. It's pretty old. You ever play Fat Princess? I did. It was a lot of fun. Yeah, it is a lot of fun. Is there still a, is there still a community? <laughs> uh, I don't I, I don't know. I, <laughs> <laughs> what is fat, what is Fat Princess about? So, okay, does anybody have an Xbox? Um, no. Okay. No. <laughs> um, it's on PlayStation 3 as well. Fat Princess is a game where you're like a mage, a knight, an archer, um, and you try to get to the other side and steal their princess. But the more cake you give her, the fatter she gets and the harder she is to move. Mm-hmm. So, but in, <laughs> it's hilarious, and you can you can chop down trees, and I don't remember what it does for you. It like gives you yeah, you can like buff your characters and yeah. shit like that. You collect uh, materials to get better people. Oh my! God. That sounds <laughs> like, great. I'm googling it right now. This is it's hilarious. Yeah, it's an yeah, awesome that, game. It's pretty damn good. Is it on PC? I don't think. I think it was a Sony exclusive. Is it on yeah, PlayStation probably. Two? No, it's nah. PS3. Shit, is a three? Is a three dimer? Three dimer. <laughs> three dimer. <laughs> is it on Sega Dreamcast? Probably. I think I think that's where they started, but then it Dreamcast died, and they had to upgrade. You know, the best game to ever come out for Dreamcast, not Crazy Taxi, but it was like Soul Calibur. Soul Calibur was the best game for Sega. Well, I, I think people would argue with you that it was Shinmu. What'd you say? <laughs> <laughs> I hate you so much. <laughs> Did you say Shinmu? Can you enunciate, please? Shen. Shen. Mu. Shen. Shinmu. Yes. Is that the game with the dude who has a brown jacket? And he's sort yes. of looking over his shoulder a lot? Yes. Let me Google okay. it. <laughs> what? Shinmu. I don't, I don't want I don't... 
<laughs> He's he has a brown jacket. You are correct. Oh, yes. I played the game for about two seconds and hated it. But anyway. Oh, this is the game with the guy that has a brown jacket. Yeah, that's the game with the dude that has a fucking brown jacket. Oh, okay. That's now what I'm talking about. Mostly what I remember from that. Man, I miss demo discs from back in that era. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Those were awesome. No, what? They were great. They had like lots of little tiny shitty games on them. Right. They were a lot of fun when you had no money, but you had a magazine subscription. Dude, I played the shit out of the Final Fantasy VII demo. <laughs> awesome. Like, I played a lot of the... Oh, go ahead. I was going to say, like, nonstop fucking play that game. But... I played the... Go ahead. Yeah, that Radio Future demo disc a sounds, lot. Sounds terrible. And that game, I think it... I don't know if it's still free, but it was free on Steam recently. Yeah. I've uh, never played Final Fantasy VII. Well... You're dumb. Yep. No, I guess I am too. <laughs> um, it's all right. Like if it, it's one of those games that, like, if you played in the time, it was great. But if you play it now, it would probably be pretty hard to to stomach because it, it's right when the 3D modeling came out. It's right. fantastic oh. now. If no, it's fantastic. It. Just go out and buy it. No joke. Just go fucking buy it and sink a hundred hours into it. It yeah. is the best, one of the best games. Go, go so buy cool. the black label PS One disc. That's like four hundred dollars. <laughs> Wasn't it just released on iOS too? Yeah, but you can't do that. You have, <laughs> you have to experience it in its original form <laughs> on a oh. PlayStation One. <laughs> Yeah. Wait, I, I think I still have the three disc PlayStation. I think it was, Play, was it PlayStation 1 or PlayStation 2? I can't remember, but I still have the three discs of it with the black thing. Can I have $400? Is that what you're trying to tell me? On, on eBay, uh, it depends. On eBay, it looks like it's selling anywhere from 25 <laughs> to <laughs> to 295 Oh, okay. So, like, I don't know. Get right around, right around free. All right, right on. Yeah. Is that the one they're remaking now? Yeah, in uh, in chapters or whatever. Episodic format. Yeah, that's dumb. <laughs> Anyways, well, I am playing. Jim, nobody I'm, cares. Jim, I'm nobody cares. Jim, Jim. Well, you you playing another re? Uh, you gonna play something that's remastered again? Is that what you're trying to tell me? No, I'm playing StarCraft Two: Legacy of the Void. Ooh, it's actually Any a lot of fun, feet? huh? Nothing. Did you say an HD? It. Did you say an HD? Yeah, I did. No, it's in standard <laughs> definition, Jeff. Oh, well. We are we are going down very fast. <laughs> we had a good it. rise. We had a good rise, but now <laughs> tell us about it. Starcraft. It's fucking it's Starcraft crap. too. Just the Protoss <laughs> campaign. Okay. Thanks. Guess what else I'm playing? <laughs> Guess the u- the ukulele. The no, Har- Hearthstone. <laughs> Excellent. Dude, I have been playing that game fucking nonstop on my. I, for iPhone real? Six. Have you really been? Yes, I love that game. Do you have I it? I also love Hearthstone. Yeah. So, Goblin, perfect. I'm hoping you dig this because Instant Replay Live and Jim Bob are going to be yeah. hosting a Hearthstone tournament. What? Oh, awesome. <laughs> yeah. Cool. How do so, you sign breaking up for news? Such a tournament? Breaking well, news, exactly. Yeah. Breaking news. I, yeah, I just broke it here. I don't know a date right yet. Here first. But it, so it's going to be 16 people. Mm-hmm. And I'm trying to figure out a way to keep it, since our you know reach isn't huge, to keep it open for people to uh, play if they don't play it. So we're going to do basic cards only, which I think if okay. you hit level 10, you get the basic cards. Yep. Um, so yeah, and it's going to be basic cards only, 16 people, and we're probably going to give a prize to the top two maybe um but yeah i'm just working on the flyer right now cool that sounds awesome i would do that (laughs) hey jim we got one yeah yay do your janine voice from ghostbusters (laughs) jim i'm waiting wait who who the fuck's janine isn't that the (laughs) the glasses chick janine yeah oh we got one (laughs) i hate you jim (laughs) <laughs> I was like, I was like, what the fuck are you talking about? So I feel like Golem hey, and Goblin. Now, Doctor Vankman. <laughs> I feel like Golem and Goblin have such a nice rapport with each other, and they're they're friends. Where Jim and I just really hate each other. 
Uh, well, we hate each other, too. Um, but you guys are more love than hate. Yeah. That's true. Colm, would you say we hate each other? No. You know what I hate? Oh, I thought, oh. I hate fucking British I potatoes. Hate <laughs> I hate British potatoes. I shit you not. Yeah? Yes. Oh. The vague ones? They're very vague in, in their potatoing. I think I they're savory. So we totally didn't have time to talk about a topic, but I felt like sprinklers, Jim, should have been our topic tonight. <laughs> yes, Dr. Vankman. <laughs> well, so sprinklers, guys. Um, I like the tractor. Jim likes the one that goes. No, no, no. I never told you which one I like. I mean, I was asking you. I asked the questions. Which ones do you like, Jim? Let me ask you. Oh, my little nephews have this uh, octopus one. That like it just flails its arm and shoots shit all over the place. It looks like it's oh. gonna poke their eyes out. Why like, do you, I love dude, Why do you put shit in a sprinkler? That's disgusting. Well, how else are you gonna clean your septic tank? Hey, do you remember by the high school <laughs> that fucking field across the street that would always spray shit? Do you remember the? Uh, I'm not gonna say his name, but you remember uh, the <laughs> the one guy who would uh, bathe in it? <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. He would be, yeah. he'd be drinking it too. It came it came out of a slough. All this water came out of a slough, and we had like this old pipe, probably <laughs> from the fifties. And he just water in the lawn, and it always smelled like shit. We had this, ugh. and he just like it'd be hot outside, and he'd take his shirt off, and he'd oh just my God. start bathing in it and drinking it. Is the grossest thing ever, dude. <laughs> yeah, dude, that sounds pretty close to the grossest yeah. thing ever. No, there was <laughs> there was a bad one. So my. D- Jim and I played on the high school football team. We were real big stars in a, a two way school with like forty big people. Stars. Um, but so like nothing, nothing cool. We were we were all terrible. Our team sucked. Um, but there was a fucking coach who. So my dad was a coach. We had another guy that was a coach, and then there there's another coach who would just fucking come into the coach's office and just like strip butt ass naked and just start talking to the other coaches like. Hey guys, uh, that was a pretty good practice out there. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, we gotta go. Okay. You know, remember what we're talking about? <laughs> were you talking about airborne? Airborne? No, it was uh, it was it was Gibraltar. Oh yes, <laughs> with his hot daughter. Yeah. <laughs> he brought his hot daughter with him, dude. She was obviously. <laughs> She was not, <laughs> but she was like, so we were fucking, I don't know. It was a shitty high school and she was in, I don't know. She went to college or something. We were high school kids. She'd always come hang out. It's like, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> and she was that dumb. Nobody liked her. I think she ended up dating the one guy on the team that we called Pickles. For like you five think so? Years. I think so. Pickles in Gibraltar? Oh, gross. <laughs> yes. What do you guys think about that? <laughs> fucking, it's mind blown. <laughs> I think I'm in shock still. This is a... <laughs> yeah, I would be. Your high school sounds really weird. <laughs> Dude, it was, so we were the guys that we would draw dicks on everything because apparently it was really funny. Yeah. Back oh, in high <laughs> okay. Now I understand everything. Yeah. yeah, it's making a lot more sense now. <laughs> we also we also used to play um, the penis game where what? two of you, I didn't two play of that you game. would. Um, yeah, you did. You remember when you <laughs> would say... <laughs> you were really yeah, drunk. You did. <laughs> You'd say the word... So you say the word penis quietly, and then the other person has to say it louder than you do. And then by the end of the game, somebody's yelling the word penis. It was hilarious to high school kids. Yeah, we were Totally dumb. played that. <laughs> yeah, we were dumb. I hate high school. I anyway. Like... <laughs> go, I'm sorry, go ahead. You want to play it now? No. <laughs> Stop it. I'm gonna end the call if you guys do that. <laughs> All right, so we're we're gonna end it here. <laughs> okay, we're like 35 minutes. Holy shit! Um, oh, yeah. So right Golden Goblin, thanks guys. Really appreciate it. Um, man, you guys, I, I do love your your Bioshock Infinite Let's Plays. I haven't had time to to scour into the deepest dungeon that Goblin's playing, but I know you're playing it, and it's next. Cool. And I dig, right dude. I, I dig slimes uh, underplay or Undertale. Awesome, play great. Through. Yeah, well, so, I'll pass that guys, message along. Yeah, I mean, and she told the story about her teeth, and that's crazy. 
Uh, yeah. yeah. That's an ongoing thing. <laughs> yeah. So if yeah. you want to hear more about Slime's teeth, check out Golem and Goblin. <laughs> well, it's actually Slime's Undertale playthrough on Golem and Goblin's channel. It's fucking confusing. Exactly. Yes. But the <laughs> fucking welcome. link is in the description, so y'all can fucking figure it out, right? Cool. Hey, can, can you uh, also put the link to Fish Face's video while you're at it? Fish Face. Thanks. Thanks. Yeah, Fish Face has a new video coming out, I think, this week sometime. It's Game Jolt Fish. Arcade. What? Game Jolt Arcade. Game Jolt Arcade. Yes. I thought you guys don't have a Fish Face. Well, I'm I'm, pre- I'm assuming that that slot will still be open, and that'll be their video. <laughs> oh, cool. Sweet. All right. Well, be sure to check it out. So, man, again, thank you guys. I really appreciate it. I know it's not Monday when we normally record, but thanks for being flexible with us. Um, Jim yes. Jim had work to do, I guess. What a effed it up, effed it all up. So many many thanks <laughs> to Golem and Gollum and Fishface and Slimer and the rest of you crazy <laughs> kids out there. And and uh, Jimmy, thanks as yeah. always, buddy. Thank thank you. And listening, was pleasurable. <laughs> It's about as pleasurable as your mom. Ew. Ew. Um, but Ew. Listening, listening audience, thank you. Be sure to check out our Stink Flicks movie review of The Traveler. We might have another one coming up soon, as soon as we can get to it. Mm-hmm. It's going to be a fucking terrible one. It's always <laughs> it Well, not our, our review will be great. The movie's terrible. <laughs> Idiots. <laughs> Anyways. All right, guys. Cool. Thanks, guys. Hey, yeah, yeah thanks good. for having us. Love you guys. <laughs> hope it wasn't too traumatizing. Yeah, I hope Jim didn't traumatize you with his penis jokes. Well, I didn't yeah. even make a penis joke. It's a penis game, not a joke. <laughs> <laughs> nice warm shower. Wash all that off. And yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right, guys. Talk cool. to you later. All right, thanks, guys. Bye. Bye. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching our show. Hey, by the way. Thanks. <laughs> If you really enjoyed it, uh, press the subscribe button and the like button, please. And then check out these other videos that are magically appearing right now. It's Thank you. magic. <laughs>